So I'm recording something. I don't really record too much about how I am. So those that know my story, they know that I have autism and it's sometimes really difficult for me to process things. And I just came across a story that is so that I um I just um I'm okay I'm okay um I think is not acceptable and I've talked about racism and for those that do not know um I'm gonna play this clip. And if you care about autistic people, or if you claim that you're not racist, this boy has autism. He's playing bas basketball. And I was in middle school. When I was in middle school, I had a kid who was black that threw a textbook at the back of my head twice because of humor and because he wanted to make people laugh and because he was black and I was white. This story is so reminiscent of me having intense abuse and being permanently disfigured where I see double vision in each eye. I'm diagnosed. I have to constantly worry if I will have a brain aneurysm by a cranial indent in the back of my head. He says the N word nigger accidentally. And I will let you watch this because I had a very serious experience in my life that I could not be a scientist. I couldn't go into the military. I gave up a lot of sports and became a bookworm because of an event just like this. And I cannot tell you how painful it is as someone who was attacked in a very stronger way. I'm just gonna play the video. And if you think that you care about human rights, and if you think that you care about autism, and if you think that you are not racist and you're black, well, this is what I have to show you. On a regular basis, um, um, the, um, the, um, I'm trying to process this. I'm not doing very well. I'm here. And I'm grounding myself because this is happening so much to white people. And this is not okay. Okay. 